A debacle at North Korea's principal atomic testing site has left around 200 individuals dead, as indicated by Japanese reports, and specialists fear the fall could spread radioactive material around the whole side of the equator. Around 100 individuals were executed when an incomplete passage crumbled at Kim Jong-un's fundamental atomic testing site, provoking a scramble in which 100 individuals hence kicked the bucket while endeavoring to protect the principal gathering of buried specialists. Remote specialists had cautioned a crumple was likely, featuring the risk of a billow of radioactive aftermath getting away from the site and spreading over a whole half of the globe with calamitous results. Express reports the debacle was uncovered by Japan's TV Asahi today, in spite of the fact that they couldn't illuminate when the mishap and ensuing bound safeguard endeavors occurred. They said North Korean sources revealed to them the crumble happened as specialists were taking a shot at the new passage. A moment fall occurred as laborers attempted to save their associates. Pungiri was the site of North Korea's sixth since forever atomic test on September 3. They tried a tremendous 100 kiloton dangerous which was around seven times as effective as the bomb dropped on Hiroshima amid World War II. This test is believed to have gravely destabilized the mountainside-based office. Remote specialists and human rights activists had cautioned for the current month, be that as it may, of the threat of autocrat Kim Jong-un's disintegrating offices. North Korea's exploded its first since forever H-bomb in September making genuine harm the office's establishment. Ensuing little quakes have since demonstrated the zone was winding up progressively temperamental. The Pungaira test site is incorporated with Mount Mantap, expanding profound inside the mountain. While the correct areas of the atomic tests themselves remain a secret, seismologists trust they can pinpoint it to a 100-meter range. While a test site could be worked securely at such an area, Unsophisticated designers are accept to have expanded the danger of calamity with unrefined boring methods. China issued a desperate cautioning to Kim in regards to the condition of the atomic testing site. They said a billow of atomic aftermath could spread over a whole half of the globe if the office crumbled. The Chinese Academy of Sciences Institute of Geology and Geophysics cautioned, China can't sit and hold up until the point when the site implodes. Our instruments can distinguish atomic aftermath when it arrives, yet it will be past the point of no return by at that point. There will be open frenzy and outrage at the legislature for not making a move. Chillingly, before news broke today of the fall, they had cautioned such a crumple could spread radioactive material far and wide. They stated, the aftermath can spread to a whole half of the globe. Paul Richards a seismologist at Columbia University's Lamont Doherty Earth Observatory, stated, What we are seeing from North Korea resembles some sort of worry in the ground. In that piece of the world, there were worries in the ground, yet the blasts have shaken them up. On Monday South Korea likewise cautioned another atomic test at the site could prompt an aggregate fall of the mountain office, causing a lethal hole of radioactive materials. Regardless of the possibility that a radioactive break does not occur, the fiasco is an immense hit to Kim. The new passage was likely important to help modernize the office and its fall will seriously moderate North Korea's atomic advance. Checking Bunch 38 North said for the current month, if North Korea were to endeavor to keep testing under this mountain, for example, in the zone more toward the eastern side, at that point we would hope to see new burrowing later on close to the North Portal, still under Mount Mantap.